Thanks for staying with us. And as promised, Guy Metzger's here to show us some of the technique in the various different martial arts that he has trained in and has won championships in. Guy, thanks a lot for coming on the mat with us. Well, look, could you do us a favor and say take um, two or three typical attack techniques and show us how you would handle those with the different types of experience that you have? Certainly, certainly. Okay, but, but Guy, not, not with me. <laughs> I, I know you brought someone to help you out, okay? So I'll bow out to you guys and let you go ahead. Okay. Thank you. Uh, first, I'd like to introduce my Uki here. This is um, uh, Kurt Pittman. Kurt Pittman is one of the trainers down in Freestyle Martial Arts. He's a United States kickboxing champion and uh, upcoming star in the kickboxing field. Uh, what we're going to demonstrate here um, is uh, some techniques, again, some typical self-defense uh, situations that uh, you would uh, come against, uh, kicks, punch, grabs, things like uh, that nature. And we'll demonstrate uh, karate-oriented techniques and then demonstrate uh, the uh, pancreas-style uh, submission techniques. So what you're going to get is a point of view from what a uh, striker would use and also the techniques that a grappler would use or, uh, you know, the wrestling or judo, jiu-jitsu-style martial arts would use. Okay, what we're going to demonstrate here, as I'm going to break it down slowly, is self-defense techniques against uh, typical attacks, grabs, punches, kicks, and uh, re you know rear grabs. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain them and then I'll do them fast motion for you because I think it'll be easy to break it down to see what you're seeing. Okay, a typical situation, you're attacked by an assailant with uh, a punch. It's a typical punch. Use your sidekick to use his body motion into him, drive a powerful technique into his midsection. Roundhouse kick to the thigh to bring him down and finish him with a jump turn heel kick which is a very powerful finishing technique. That looks like fast. It's like this. Okay, next we're going to work on the kick, which uh, a lot of people do study martial arts, and uh, you may come up against an assailant with a martial arts experience. He's going to throw a, a roundhouse kick at me. I'm going to block, use his locomotion to a jump back kick to the body, step up side kick to finish him. Okay, fast, it looks something like this. Okay, next technique, the grab from behind, okay? Sandler comes up, grabs you from behind. Immediately you want to see who, <laughs> who's grabbed you, make sure it's not one of your buddies just goofing off and you want to finish him off. So I look over, I don't recognize this individual. I use a strike to the top of the foot to loosen his grip. Elbow strike to the temple and jaw area to loosen him up. Grab his hand, step underneath into a wrist lock, bend him down. Finish him with the front kick to the face. Looks like this fast. Okay, uh, front grab, either uh, lapel grab. Since I'm not wearing a shirt, well, he's going to do it from a choke. But uh, you can do it if he was grabbing hold of your collar, which is more of a common hold than really the front choke. So we're right here like this. What I'm going to do, collapse his arms in. Use a headbutt to strike down to the nose, strike to the midsection or groin, sweep to his foot, bring him down, and finish with the stomp when he's down, okay? All right, fast it looks something like this. Okay, and uh, those are your common grabs right there. Now what we're going to demonstrate is uh, the grappler's point of view from each one of these techniques, okay? And uh, I'm going to demonstrate, demonstrate them uh, 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 slowly to you in, in the same order that we did there. I'm going to have to take the mic off because we will roll on the ground and I don't, uh, don't want to uh, hurt myself or hurt the mic. But uh, we're going to start with the punch, then the kick, and then the grab from behind and then the, uh, the uh, uh, front grab. So uh, we'll, we'll do them slow, and I think you'll be able to follow what's going on. Okay, uh, and also, um, after this, I'll demonstrate the different locks. If you're not familiar with locks uh, on the legs and different things like that, I'll show you the different how, how that works. Okay.
One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> and the champ is Guy Metzger. <laughs> Listen, we really appreciate your help tonight. Thank you very much. Thanks, Kirk. Guy, I can't thank you enough for coming by and showing us some of this wonderful technique. And uh, for any of you that would like to have more information, Guy Metzger trains at Freestyle Martial Arts here in Dallas, Texas, in the Park City area. Guy, thanks. My pleasure, sir. I